even if Miller's experiment were valid, you're still light years away from making life. It comes down to this. No matter how many molecules you can produce with early Earth conditions, plausible conditions, you're still nowhere near producing a living cell. And here's how I know. If I take a sterile test tube and I put in a little bit of fluid with just the right salts, just the right balance of acidity and alkalinity, just the right temperature, the perfect solution for a living cell. And I put in it one living cell. This cell is alive. It has everything it needs for life. Now I take a sterile needle and I poke that cell and all its stuff leaks out into this test tube. You have in this nice little test tube all the molecules you need for a living cell. Not just the pieces of the molecules, but the molecules themselves. And you cannot make a living cell out of them. You can't put Humpty Dumpty back together again. So what makes you think that a few amino acids dissolved in the ocean are going to give you a living cell? It's totally unrealistic.